Hey guys, um, just a quick update. Since I wasn't at the game on Sunday, that's just being because I was at work. Wigan Warriors won 42 to 10 away at Huddersfield. That is one unbelievable scoreline, especially with the fact that at that point Huddersfield were on top of the table. No Warriors are now top of the table. By the way, guys, if you were wondering when I'm there, Yes, it is the new shirt that I do have. Yep, it is the new home shirt. And yes, I have my name on it. So yeah, there is that. Also, as you might now notice, my hair has been dyed. Freshly dyed today. <laughs> it's purple. Even though it's looking a bit gray, a bit grayish and all sorts, but. Every now and then, yes, I have got a game going on at the moment. I am playing FIFA. But ignore the fact that I'm playing FIFA. <coughs> that doesn't really matter. So the light will be obviously changing around because I have, I've got FIFA on in the background. Make sure I have muted that. Just in case that does decide to go on. As the PC decides to kick in and around. While I'm doing that. Now, just a quick update. I am going to be at the Warriors Hull KR, Hull Kingston Rovers. The second team from Hull. In two weeks, I will be at that game on Sunday. I have got a good spot. I am this time going to be halfway up the stand. So I'll get a bit better view, hopefully. Sorry about my fingers being in the way. I'm still messing about with this tripod at the moment because it is slipping. It is one which is a little bit dodgy at the moment. So this tripod is just going to fall. But I am going to be there. I will be doing that. And also, I've booked the tickets. Tickets. For a double day at Alton Towers, end of April into early May. So I'll be able to go back there. And I've actually got two days going on. So that's that one going on. Also, yeah, sorry I didn't do any other updates apart from that. And I know some of you have been asking me on Messenger and all sorts of other things why I'm doing rugby content. Because I can. I couldn't come up with any other, other ideas. I don't really want to do the football stuff. I did say that there might be the sister channel. Not the sister channel, the sister thing two bleeding cherry and white but at the moment i just don't have the motivation to do the other stuff to do with football i can't i don't really have that motivation yeah all right likes are now all right they're not well they're not all right they are out of the relegation zone but they're still going to be in the relegation scrap for the rest of the season but it is going to take them time now yeah all of the bits I've watched and some of the games that I've been watching when I have gone to the football, it has been all right. But uh, they just have thrown it away a bit at times. But for some reason now they've just clicked and they've just started kicking on a bit. But I know things are a bit on and off. But I'm going to try and concentrate on the rugby for this season. And if I can be bothered, then I will do the football stuff. But I don't really know what I'm going to call that. That one could literally just be up the ticks. I don't know. But Bleeding Cherry and White seems to be going alright. Because the second episode. Thank you to everyone who did view that. Because that is the fastest that one of my videos has gone above 100 views. When I looked at it earlier, over 350 views. Alright, that's all after a week. But... That was at 150 views on Monday morning. Thank you, guys. <laughs> you just proved that. Yeah, all right. I'm prattling about my edits aren't brilliant. Uh, ain't exactly brilliant. But you know what? I don't care, to be honest. I know my edits are bad, but that's me. I like doing it that way. I'll always do the che Even if I'm doing a cheesy intro piece, I'll do it that way. Yeah, all right. I am going to have to work in an entry card on that. Now, that's going to be about a 5 to 10 second little card that's just going to have the club shield and bleeding cherry and white and a couple of other bits and pieces around it. I don't know yet, but I am going to be working on that. As for the other stuff, so like I've now just said, there is going to be the Alton Towers stuff. So I am going to be at Alton Towers. So I've got two days at Alton Towers. So there's going to be, it's not going to be in two halves. It's going to be two things smushed together. They're going to be together. There probably will be some off rides and stuff like that that I will be uploading at the same time. But I've still got to work that out. Also, I am going to need a better action cam. Rather than this thing. 
because that doesn't really cut it to be honest so i'm probably going to have to get myself a gopro there is that now as for people who are possibly wanting to know about urbex stuff i don't know if i'm going to be doing any more urbex stuff to be honest because the last one i did was the old college and that was thrashed to hell now when i looked at possibly going back in there the entryway i used was blocked up and to be honest, I can't really be bothered searching around for another entry point. It's, it's that place has now been done so many times, I don't really know what else to do with that. So I'm probably going to find either somewhere else to do her back or whatever, or I might just not bother with it. I might go concentrate more on the sport end, stick more with rugby and stuff like that. But hey, as we get more ink work done, because I know some people at work and a couple of people that know me do know I only want to get some more ink work done. So I am going to be getting more ink work done at some point. I just need to get the time to be able to do it. I need to get some time off from work. I need to be able to actually do things. There's probably going to be another one, another run up to Blackpool. If it wasn't going to be the rugby this weekend, then yeah, all right, I would be up at Blackpool on the Saturday because I have got a weekend off. Now, yeah, I am recording this during the daytime on a Wednesday. I have got a Wednesday off work. Highly unusual, because I'm usually through the week, or I do a Sunday to Thursday. But this time, because we're trialling the split shifts at work, so things are going a bit differently. But we'll find out soon. Don't know what's going on with Sheffield yet. I'm still waiting on that, because I have just done some bloods. So I have had some bloods done a couple of weeks ago. Now, they will be coming in at some point. Now, yeah, as you can see, yes, I do have a bit of shadow. I've dyed my hair, so that is a picked up on whatever stubble I've got. So some of the dye has leached across onto my stubble. So I'm going to have to shave again in a while. Uh, as you can see just behind me, yeah, there is a sketch on the wall. This wallpaper in here is probably not going to be like this. This room is going to be dark and gothic. You can probably see the leather from the back of my headboard. That is going to be staying. This is going to be a bit of a, a gothic room. This is going to be my sanctuary. My den. I'm not going to be able to get away with the garish orange like I did at the old place. That was that was then. This is now. But yeah, this will start to become more and more purpley red and pinky and all sorts of stuff as time goes on, as more gets washed through. Yes, I have got Foxy. It glows. It does glow in the dark. But yes, so things are slowly evolving. I am getting better at my edits. I'm going to be getting better at doing this as well. But at the moment, this is just on a crappy tripod. This is just a quick update. Now, all I know is up till about May, that's what's coming along. So there will be a trip to Blackpool at some point. I just need to get some time to do that. There is going to be more bleeding cherry and white. There might be a football piece where I might try something at the football, but I really don't think so. There is going to be the Alton Tower stuff. I may end up doing that in two parts, day one, day two, like I have done prior. But I might just smush them together and do that and get some more fries, get some things like that, do more opinions on things. Because I'm going to be having two days, I'm also going to be in the hotel on site as well. So I'll be doing that. So I'll probably get a bit of chance to upload, upload some stuff that I've found. I'm also definitely going to have another review of the craziness that is there. Wickerman is definitely going to get some, some more rides. That's for definite. As for the Smiler, I'm going to go back on it. And I'm still holding my It Was A Box Of. Make of it as you will. Those transitions did feel a bit rough and they did bounce you in a bit. It did feel a little bit off at times. It was fun, but because it is so compact, everything was on top of you just after one after one. That's what I didn't like about it was it was just after, 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 after because it's so compact. Nemi, nothing compares to Nemi. Come on, guys. There won't be that with that. No. So, Nemi, yeah, Nemi is the baby of that place. Nemi is is the boss. 
I'm definitely going to be going back on Airstroke Galactica or Galactic Air, whatever the heck you want to call it. I will def be on that. I did skip it last time because the queue was so long. Now, because it is a double day and it is during the week and it is not quite going to be as full with the school kids. So I've got more chance to get some more re-rides. The weather's, I'm hoping the weather's going to be not as hot as it was then, but a bit nicer than the crap weather that we've got now, where it's been chucking it down most of the past three weeks. Now, all right, as you guys did notice, out of the rugby last time out, it was actually quite dry. Now, that was a rarity, and that was a reprieve from the shite weather that we've had. But for now, peace.